Hey there everybody, um, just making another update. So this is the prototype horizontal hip joint for the hexapod project. Um, I've posted about it before though I don't think I ever got a video up. But basically there are two um, hub assemblies, hub bearing assemblies, like um, out of a car actually, uh, in line with each other connected on either side by frames so that this side over here can uh, pivot about. And it's all mounted very crudely on this ugly metal stand. Um, so I had that, that's been, I've had that for a while, but just tonight I got the real hydraulics hooked up for the first time, uh, which is this, driving this cylinder, which is uh, one inch bore and four inch travel. Um, it's pretty much fully extended right here. It's still being controlled um, from the test bed I was using earlier um, with this directional control switch, except I've replaced the tiny little pump that used to be there with this much bigger pump here, um, which now has to be powered from this battery, which does not last very long at all because this thing just, just guzzles amps. Um, but basically it's all just controlled from this switch um, it's a double pole, double throw, so not only does it control the directional control valve here, but it also turns the pump on and off uh, via the uh, starter solenoid there. And so I'm about to run it and getting far back to make sure it doesn't hit me because that would be very, very bad as you will see. As you can see, it's already getting less violent in this motion because the battery is actually being drained just that quickly. But you can get a sense of how fast the legs will be moving side to side. Um, which is decent, I think. And uh, you can also get a sense of just how deadly this thing will be. Um, this would absolutely take off fingers if you got too close and I suspect it might just take off a limb if you let it. So um, this is, this, this project's moving into a whole new level of fun. Uh, so next step will be hopefully adding the rest of the leg. This was really the hard part, so uh, a little bit more tweaking on this first, but um, it's not bad. 